first video for 2017-2018, Maya is coming along with me, largely because she's responsible for what I was thinking of for this video. Yeah, so this one woke me up at three in the morning and it just started, she just started triggering, she just started triggering ideas, um, namely about fake news. Because one of the things that we'll be doing in the session on Friday is thinking about public attitudes and popular media in relation to Marie Antoinette. Um, Marie Antoinette is a figure who is sort of liberally destroyed in popular media and through unofficial pamphleting and leafleting. Um, just to the target of a succession of character assassinations. There was some really... Um, not just salacious material that's being put, um, published about her, but some you know, pretty inappropriate stuff. Um, you know, um, family-based incest more than anything. Um, an incest with her own children, which is pretty extreme as salacious material goes. Now, there's absolutely nothing to say that any of these slurs against her character and her behavior were actually true. Um, it did just seem to be part of a wider scale um, false character assassination, you know, the very definition of what we talk about in relation to fake news. But just as fake news is defined by its content, it's also defined by how willing people are to accept it. And that was very much the case with Marie Antoinette. Um, during her own trial, um, some of those more dubious accusations made about what she did in her private life were brought against her in a courtroom. Such was the level of acceptance of the things that she was uh, claimed to have done or be associated with. So <clears throat> fake news is something that's certainly very powerful um, and there's probably no escaping it in today's media but don't be mistaken into thinking or don't be misled into thinking that it's something new for the Trump administration. Um, it is something that is inherent throughout historical narratives and perhaps no more so is it plain to see its application and very successful application in terms of if you think of how public attitudes turned on my internet um, than its use in France. Might do this one without her next time.